Hey guys, welcome back to another video, and today, well, let's start with a bit of a slight recap as what I've done a bit of off-camera. So, I firstly, as you can see in my hotbar, I have got a ton of all my stuff. I've got my plasma-proof helmet, my thrusters, my plasma pants, my plasma boots, my plasma, plasma fortune, plasma spade, plasma paster, plasma sword, plasma mini scythe, plasma pulse rifle, and plasma axe. The only thing I haven't done is um, taken this and done this and there we go, serious dedication. I got it on camera. Um, whoops. And so, yeah. Um, I have officially gotten all my different, um, things. And so now, I am fully kitted out with my own armor, and to prove it, um, I have, like, green and all their stuff. I did have to, as you can see on my hotbar down here, I have got a lot of XP because I have kind of overcounted how much XP I would need. So I've got all the enchantments I need for all my stuff. There's probably one or two I'm missing, but these work fine right now. And I did stop at some places and, um, like... I stopped at Tango Tex to steal some rockets, because, well, I mean, I could totally make my own with all my gunpowder and paper, but I'm lazy, so I used rockets to get rockets. Okay, anyways, you're probably wondering, what is my base going to be? And this is part of it. This. I'm not going to place it down because I don't know if I can grab it back up again. Um, but this little conduit is what I needed. And how how I got this, you may be asking. Well, Grian had it hard of the sea in one of his chests. So I, stag I snagged that. And then I went to a shop in the shopping district. It took about 30 minutes, but I found one that was selling some uh, Nautilus shells. They were kind of pricey, but I bought some. And now I've got this. And um, if we actually go back here to my mob drops, um, I've got some spares. I've got a total for two spares, or not spares, and just two more. I don't exactly know if anyone else has any more, but. Boy, do I have a lot of work ahead of me. Let's actually grab this in case I need to shoot something. So, these are all my boxes. I'm probably going to pack up the ones I think I'm going to need. But, before I do that, I'm going to go find a spot for me to build. Okay, so we've got a slight problem with the nether portal and llama problem, but other than that, everything is going fine. Um, let me... Oh, you're kidding. Okay. 
Okay, so um, this is where I'm going to be building. First part is going to be, actually, let me explain what I'm going to do. So, the premise of it is kind of like sci-fi avatar-ish. Um, first part I'm going to do is like an underground water city. Then I'm going to do like Earth sci-fi Earth Kingdom. Probably then some like air nobat. Oh, bleh, I can't talk. Uh, sci-fi air nomads, and then probably some sci-fi fire nation. Um, I'd like to involve a story, but right now the story is unfinished, and so yeah. This is all my stuff right now, so I guess I'm going to empty out my inventory. Oh, and also, on the bright side, I am unintentionally, if my game will load in, right next to Turf War, which is also right next, if it'll load in, give it a second, next to the shopping district. So, I don't have to use portals anymore to get to the shopping district, which I was having to do, and it was obnoxious. So, yeah. Um... Won't be needing that anymore. Um, and I'll probably figure out a better place to put that right now. But I kind of want to start on the um, city. So I'm basically going to do a couple trips back and forth between um, here and Green Space to get all my stuff over here. That way I can actually... Um, build, you know. So, queue up, uh, moving time lapse, I guess, and placing time lapse. Whatever, hit it. stuff kind of sorted behind me but it's all um all, everything i think i need is here if i need something i'll just fly back over um that way but i think it's time to do the first part of this city that is make a conduit i probably should have flown in but um this ocean isn't deep here um so i think i'm just gonna do it like right around here I think it's a five by five gosh um, and then I do that and then and that'll there we go I love that look um, Sadly, it does not make breaking things easier. Well, actually, maybe I was wrong. Maybe, I don't know. Like, let's see. Well, I mean, it's not the quickest thing, but I'll probably get a... Um, if, uh, haste beacon up and running up here. Um, so yeah. Now I just need to construct a tower or something around this.
now that we've got that done, um, a little update before we wrap up the video. Had a few creeper explosions over here, um, since I forgot hadn't lit up the place. Um, I didn't lose anything, I don't think. But, um, I also brought over some shulker boxes, like all my mob drops and stuff. And then I made a little nylium patch so I could grow some wart trees, which I used for the temple over here. I really like it. Um, and so I found this really cool idea with the um, that uh, the using the stripped wood as the beams and stuff. I'm not so sure if I like it being in the the inside of the logs being in the window. Window. I might switch that to um the one on four sides. And then we got this. Probably my favorite part of this uh, temple kind of place. That's what I'm calling this. I also caged up this as if it was sacred or something. Um, but so just some ice under some trap doors, snow, um, cyan, and like white glazed terracotta, I'm pretty sure. And then blue terracotta, glazed terracotta, with some prismarine. Um, and then, yeah, we got this. Um, and then the tunnel, it's nice, you can look out on all sides while you're walking through or whatever. Um, it doesn't always work on the ground since we're so low, but, um, this is a, like, I guess, tileable design. Or can you use that to describe a building piece? Um. So yeah, basically, um, two block gap in between the windows, and that's all you need to, to make it tile. And um, I like it. Um, kind of, it doesn't feel super powerful, um, but it's like does look ancient and also very underwater kind of. But that's about it for this episode, so, um, don't worry, I've still got my armor, I'm just not wearing it. So, um, like and subscribe if you feel so inclined, and that's the air. Um, I'll talk to you next time. Goodbye! Ah, Dolphin Power!